Hi everybody, my name is Jimmy Flat, and I'm going to show you how to add storage to a case. Uh, this is for design for manufacturing, and this case happens to be my bow case. The problem with this case is that every time I close it, the gear that's free to float around ends up on the bow. To solve this problem, I first needed to design an arrow rack that could be mounted to the existing holes in the bow case. In SolidWorks, I created a 3D model that could be 3D printed as a positive for the molding process. Unfortunately, this first design was not going to be easy to mold, so I went back to the drawing board and made a new one that would be. Now with a functional positive made, it was time to create a mold of it. I started by making a box out of foam fill board for the mold. Next, with the positive 3D print glued to the bottom of the box, I filled the box with smooth cast silicone rubber Fumu 30. Cured, it was time to take out the positive. To select the correct resin to pour, I received sample discs from SmoothOn and decided to go with Simpack 60 to match the material properties of the existing arrow holder. After the rubber cured, the part turned out near perfect with the exception of a few holes caused by air pockets. Sadly, on the second and third pour of the rubber, it did not cure correctly, so I made a new mold and repeated the process to make one more arrow rack. To solve the problem of all the loose boxes and tools in the case, I wanted to make some kind of pocket. To do this, I used a piece of paper to make a stencil to cut out the fabric. Using the sewing machine, I stitched together the mesh fabric to the elastic band that would be used for the front of the pocket. Next, I stitched the mesh with elastic band to the backing fabric to create the pocket. I repeated the process to make another pocket to fill the rest of the unused space on the lid of the case. Lastly, I fixtured the pockets and the arrow holders to the lid of the case with screws. Hi everybody, now that you've seen how I've added storage to my case, let's see if it works. <laughs> 